Hello everybody, it's Dark Strider, the YouTube Assassin, and today I want to discuss the whole Assassin's Creed Odyssey that everybody has been hearing about that's been leaked. Basically, it's another Assassin's Creed game that's coming out, um, possibly this summer, possibly the end of this year. Now, as I look into it, and, and we know a couple of things, we know that it's going to take place in Greece, this is just another reason why I'm letting you all know that Bayek is getting a trilogy, okay? Now, in this video, there's going to be some spoilers, and there's going to be a history lesson involved because that just makes my point, all right? So that being said, here we go. Now, as you know, the end of Assassin's Creed Origins, the main game, it ends with Caesar being murdered, okay? Okay? Now, that was actually a part of history. It really happened. He was stabbed 23 times, all right? Now, what you may not know is that Caesar was actually popular with the middle and lower classes, so a lot of them were willing to follow him, and they were pretty angry that their hero was killed by a bunch of upper-class people, all right? Now, during this time, it kind of caused a civil war between Mark Anthony and he was fighting Brutus and Cassius, okay? Now, Brutus and Cassius were amassing an army in Greece, all right? That's most likely where all this is going to take place, okay? During that time, Mark Anthony forms an alliance with Cleopatra, all right? And he wants to use the amazing wealth of Egypt in order to conquer Rome, all right? So he's basically going to be using uh, Cleo in order to get his own uh, things accomplished. Now, uh, like I said, this is all historical, all right? This all takes place about 30 BCE, which, as you know, uh, when it comes to BCE, everything goes in descending order. So it'll be like, you know, whatever, 50 million BCE, and then it goes down to like 1 BCE. All right. So that is actually where uh, this game takes place actually in 44 BC or a little bit uh, earlier. And then it goes, you know, downward. So if they're keeping up with the time, if they're keeping up with the with the time frame, then yes, uh, uh, all this stuff is going to be happening. And we're going to see Aya even murder uh uh, Cleopatra because Cleopatra in 30 BC was be said to you. have committed suicide so we're gonna, probably going to find out that no she didn't commit suicide it was Aya that killed her all right um, you know Caesar was prepped to invade Parthia Cautious and Scythia I hope I said those right and uh, you know those are probably things that we're going to see happening we're probably going to see uh, you know, like the, the pre preparation for all that from, you know, Mark Anthony himself, obviously, because Caesar had died. So it's just going to be a really, really interesting game. It's going to be interesting to see what they do. And like I said, because of all this, it just gives me the, the you know, I kind of feel like that's the proof that I needed in order to, you know, know that. Yes, Bayek is getting a trilogy. This is going to be the second game in Bayek's trilogy. Greece is actually like a very good uh, uh, next step because it would have been the next step in history. Okay, so just based on those few things that I just let you know, that actually happened. There was actually, you know, like a Mark Anthony and, you know, uh, uh, like I said, the uh, lower class was actually upset that Caesar was killed. And it just started a whole big civil war. And, you know, it, at the center of that was Mark Anthony. And it was him against Brutus and Cassius. Again, they're amassing a, a army over in Greece. So, you know, we're probably going to do a lot of travel between Greece and Egypt. All right. Maybe even get a couple of missions where, uh, you know, Bayek is going to Greece in order to, like, kind of quell this... Uh, uprising and stuff like that and maybe Aya stays behind and you know she keeps an eye on what Cleopatra is doing in Egypt and maybe even you know like stops her we'll probably get to the point where like she gets killed by Aya who is now Amunet 
and we'll probably even see like we saw in the uh what do you call it like we like we saw in uh assassin's creed 2 when you got down into that little tomb and you find out that amonet killed cleopatra with a snake maybe we'll even see that you know a throwback to the game which i i find just very interesting now uh as far as like a, a third game i i don't know what they're going to do with a third game we'll have to see what they end up doing with uh odyssey in order to see you know like at, at what point we leave off in the game or in history and then i'd probably be able to make a, a bigger determination there but you know this actually has me really excited uh, I kept saying, and you know, you could see I have a bunch of videos where, you know, I did believe that there was going to be a Bayek trilogy. And, you know, this just kind of like makes me feel good. This just kind of gives me vindication. Like, yeah, you know, I'm not crazy. I, <laughs> I had a belief in that. Someone and and this is what happened. So let's keep an eye out for it. Let's see what happens. You know, uh, uh, let me know what you think in the comments below, though. Like, tell me, do you believe that uh, this is what's going to happen? Do you believe that it's going to be a Bayek trilogy? Are you worried that it's going to be something else? Are you ready to move on from Bayek? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, on top of that, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. It helps the channel out a lot. And as always, thank you for watching.